Let me see that post. <laughs> I'm going to interview my friend. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, am Fred. here, live and in person. Yeah, where are you? Mench. Mench, Mench Vegas, Vegas, New Hampshire. Home, home of uh, Adam... McQuaid? No, Adam, the, the uh, movie star. Oh, Sandler. Adam Sandler. Yeah. Go Central. <laughs> <laughs> and so, for the record, I assume, I know your first name, I know your last name, but let's hear all three. What's your first, middle, and last? Mr. Craig Gerard. Gerard. After St. Gerard. Oh. Parish. Interesting. And uh, how old are you? How I old hate that are you? question. How old I are you? I especially hate the answer. 61 in a few more days. Really? <laughs> so you were born in 50, what, 7? Seven? 7, the Lord's perfect number. Really? I nailed it. Uh, and you're from uh, Germany, right? Prince Edward Island, Germany. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Edward Island. And you are the child of whom? I am the child of Joseph and Eileen McVarish. Joseph and Eileen. Two Prince Edward Islanders. And so they're native to Prince Edward Island. Much loved Islander natives. And uh, how many siblings do you have? I have two and two. Two boys, two brothers, two sisters. Kirby, an oil guy out in Alberta. Uh huh. Brady, a hockey star. Treva, my sister with nine children. Treva with nine children? And whoa, whoa, whoa. Tandy. And Candy? Tandy with a T. Treva and Tandy. TNT. Your parents were. And they uh, are. They're just like TNT. Did they make these names up? Yeah, mom made them all up. <laughs> Is this a Scottish name, Treva? And it's a book that she read when she was young. Really? My mother. And she has nine children. Treva has nine children. And where does she live? Prince Edward Island the Beautiful. And how many children do you have? I have six, five wonderful daughters and one... Hey girls, a hunk! <laughs> Patrick! Patrick. <laughs> So that is... Uh, He's that, in Alberta. That's 15. That's 15 grandchildren amongst two of their kids. So what about the other two? The other three? The other Wait. grandchildren? No. Okay, how many? Okay. 12. Wow. And okay, so uh, what did your parents do? Dad was an awesome road builder. A road builder? My mom was did, did, were they built home. <laughs> Were they dirt roads? Except for the day that she hid in the closet. From? When we got off the bus. I don't get it. She was always at home. Oh, she would hide? She hid to in the closet. To surprise you? To see what we would do, and we all freaked out. Why, why were you on the bus? Uh, we had to drive a long way. We lived in the country. Wait, you lived on an island? Yeah, but you wouldn't believe how much country is on that island. And you have to take a bus home. I have to take a bus home. When I was in grade one, though, we took a horse, a horse and sleigh. My neighbor <laughs> picked us up. That's how we got. Was this school. for school? And, and <laughs> once the once the snow was too <laughs> poor for the horses, then you would walk uphill. Then we would go with our mailman, <laughs> <laughs> who had a milk truck. Oh my gosh! I knew this was going to be rich. <laughs> Okay, so... One room uh, school. And so, uh, what are the age differences between you and your siblings? Are you all got kind of close together? Are you one of the youngest or I what? I am the eldest. You're the oldest? Absolutely. Wow, so am I. I have three brothers, no sisters. Turn, turn that camera on yourself there, Mr. Salt. I Everybody wants to see I started with me. me. I started with me. Uh, what's up? I don't know if this camera's too close, but it's G, man. San Diego, California, go Bruins! We used to have a San Diego. We used to have the San Diego goals. Andre Lacroix. Andre Lacroix. Lacroix. Sounds like he's a Canadian. No, that's German, bro. Oh, Lacroix. Okay, it's French. Okay, I'm just kidding. Okay, I have a question for you. So your parents are uh, were raised there. What about your grandparents? Yes, also raised in Prince Edward. What? Yeah. 
How many generations? Because you know you can't go back too far. There was nobody there. It's just that nobody ever left Prince Edward Island. So somebody had to be fresh off the boat. Yeah, it goes back to 1796. What? Blue blood? All the way to Surrey. Surrey. Surus, which is the French word for mouse. Wait a second. So your family is French, but your last name is McVeris, no, so you married just, into the clan? From, we sailed from Scotland over to the Maritimes, like so many. And, yeah. Yeah. And so what did your grandparents do? Uh, my grandfather, dad's father, was a foreman on the railroad. Yep, yeah, nice. The CNR. They, wait, wait, wait. A Alaska. railroad where? On the mainland. It has to be on the mainland. On the island. You got a train on the they island? Their own train. How big is this island? 165 miles from tip to tip. Interesting. And uh, something like 215 as you would drive the entire island. Okay. Yeah. And what mom was and a housewife? My, my grandmother, as far as I know, she was a stay-at-home mom. Yeah. And so what did you do when you were... Uh... On my mom's side, Dad, uh, my grandfather, we called him uh, a granddaddy. Yep. He was a, a greater man, uh, keeping those roads in top shape. Nice. And my grandmother was a stay-at-home mother, an awesome woman. That's awesome. And uh, what do your kids do? You got uh, your own basketball team. You know, a guy could just go on all night about his children. Mm-hmm. Especially my children. Yeah. yeah. Why? Kelly is just so awesome. Yeah. She's the uh, oldest of the group. And uh, she made her own video, actually, when she was about seven. And uh, I'm not sure if she was seven or eight or something like that. And she interviews the entire family. It's wonderful to see. Awesome. So she'll appreciate this. Yeah. She, she'd be a, a starter on this. Self-starter. Yep. Yeah. So she, she's she now could... working for the civil service and PEI, and, uh, and then there's Elise. Hey, Elise is one of the Screaming Eagles. Uh, I heard of it. I don't know what it is. Yeah, your Highway 101 is named after them. Uh, in the military? Yeah, 101 Regiment out of uh, uh, North Carolina, Fayette, Fayetteville. Is this Army? Army Airborne. Oh, really? Yeah, so Elise is a former sergeant there. Wow. She's now working in Prince Edward Island as a supervisor of BioVectra. Okay. Uh, so Brenna is married to a wonderful dairy farmer. Nice, lucky girl. They just love it. Wow. Love it and the children love it. How many cattle? Uh, I think there's 65 approximately. Oh, yeah, yeah. Twice a day, huh? Farmer. Twice a day? Uh, yeah. I Irregardless? I think. Uh, that when they they do better when they're kept indoors, Luke tells me. And Brenna is a, a secretary in an optometrist uh, clinic. Wow, nice. Uh, that leaves Farah. Farah is a, an all-star dental assistant. She actually worked for a surgeon just south of here, in the Salem area. Was she named after Farah Fawcett? Yes, she was. No, I I nailed it. Yes! yes! We're the same generation. Yes. I had her poster. And she looks just like her. She used to call me all the time. Greg, when are we going to go out? I'm like, Farah, I'm still in high school. Can you just wait? And she waited. Uh, okay, I, I, but I made that up. Uh, and now we're down to Patrick. Everybody yes. Everybody knows by now. Patrick's out west. Girls, Patrick's out west. You got to... British back. Columbia, Manitoba, Alberta. Alberta. And, Alberta. Yeah, and he's going to Southern Alberta Institute of Technology. Um, and my baby Lauren is now following in Ferris' footsteps. She's just about to graduate for being a dental assistant. Nice. Yeah. So you've got uh, like you've got like children with like Danish blonde hair, and they, yeah, one and, of the locals here in Manchester calls them her blondes. Yeah, but but your child uh, Patrick. He's the redhead in the group. So only one, huh? Very charming. Are any musicians in the family? Yes, yes, well, uh, indeed. What kind? Uh, we have, uh, Farah has studied some guitar. I don't mm. know if she'll admit it. Yeah. Uh, Kelly, piano, uh, both Elise and Brenna step dance. Wow. 
Patrick, uh, not sure if he plays anything except uh, YouTube. Now you have a. Uh, a, a and, oh, I didn't mean to cut you Lauren off. Lauren is an amazing um, rapper. Oh really? Yeah, I, I I don't sing. I was supposed to sing at my wedding, and then I I put a lot of reverb to kind of like make it sound decent, and then my wife says, "You know what? Never mind." <laughs> So we, you have an interest. Very wise. <laughs> uh, yes, she sang at the wedding. I just, oh. you know. Uh, so you have an interesting connection to the Boston Bruins. Look, my my relative, uh, we call him our cousin. He's actually my cousin's son, mm -hmm. Mark, and his wonderful father is Mark, and uh, they're a great family. They they are actually. Uh, What's Mark's last name? They're actually kids of my mother's sister, Geneva. Geneva. Who everyone called Jenny. That's an old school name. Yeah. And what is Mark's last name? McQuaid. They're all McQuaid. I think that Very that name sounds McQuaid. familiar. McQuaid and the Bruins. What's the? Uh, why is there? A, why does that sound familiar? Number fifty-four. Adam McQuaid. Defenseman extraordinaire. Now you you told me something interesting about how he was raised. His family had one cow. Yes, his his <laughs> grandfather. His grandfather. Yeah, and they had their own milk. And Jenny was the most amazing baker of bread, homemade bread. Nice. And then she was a big family. Uh, I think eleven kids, if not mistaken. And she put on a big pot of milk, and, hot, and she turned it into chocolate, hot chocolate. And we'd all go skating out in the pond together, and nice. come back over to Jenny's, and she'd fill us up. Awesome. An awesome aunt. My favorite aunt. So what would well, you... I have a couple of favorite. In fact, I have four or five favorite aunts. <laughs> what were you uh, What were you like in high school? Like a bookworm, a jock, or... I was, uh, I was the head of the, the social committee, which everyone would probably believe. Yes, I would. <laughs> yeah, getting the bands into the school. That's what I wanted to do. Awesome. Good. Yeah. All right. Well, I want to wrap this up. Uh, and so if there's anything you want to add before we, we conclude this uh, I just want interview. to tell you that God loves you more than I could ever tell you. And Amen. I know you already know that. So Amen. go for it. Okay. That's a great way to end. All right, brother. Thanks for the privilege. Thank you, Mr. Saltz. All right. Saltz. The great Craig McLaren. Love, love the Texans. They're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> what Texans? I'm not a Texan. You were originally from Texas. No, I'm from San Diego. San Diego Broncos. Chargers! <laughs> oh, my. And you're the social club guy? Turn that off! <laughs> <laughs>